Hi everyone, welcome to My Green Closet. So today I have a different kind of video for you. I love finding new ways of wearing clothes and for years I've been seeing this dress on Pinterest which is made out of men's shirts. And I've always wanted to try this. I think it's really interesting because it's not a sewing project. It's actually just taking the shirts and buttoning them and tying them to create a dress. So they can go back to being shirts after. So just as a fun video, I thought I would test it out with you guys and see if this really works and if it's something that you could actually wear out. So I borrowed a couple shirts from my husband to try this out with. And first I tried buttoning it up in the front and this definitely didn't work. It's much too short. So then I tried the style where you wear it backwards and tie it in the back. And I actually like how the collar looks across the top. It required some adjusting. Now, because you're wearing it backwards, it is shorter in the back than it is in the front. As you can see, it's also pretty snug across my hips. Again, getting a bigger shirt would probably help with that. The next dress I wanted to try out involves using two shirts and buttoning them together. So I buttoned it up on both sides and slipped it over my head, buttoning it up to the point where it fits snugly across the chest and wouldn't fall down. Now with this style you have four sleeves, so I decided to try just tying them all to the back. I think this actually looks cute from the front, but at the back you have all of these sleeves just hanging there. This way it worked better for length, and of course because there's a lot more fabric, it wasn't tight in the hips like the other one. I decided to try tying one set of the sleeves to the front, and this helped to reduce some of the bulk of the sleeves in the back and gives it a different look. And because obviously this isn't designed to be a dress, it bunches in weird places and you kind of have to tuck it and fold it different ways to try to get it to look nice. Okay, so of these two dresses, I think I like this one better just because it does provide more coverage, it's longer. The other one was pretty snug in the hips because of the width of the shirt. But you have the problem of having all of these sleeves which I wasn't totally sure what to do with. So I don't think that this is something that I would actually wear. I would just prefer to wear it as a shirt, but it was a lot of fun to play around with. And let me know if this is something that you would ever wear. I'll try to figure out how to create a poll up in the cards because I'm really curious what you think of it. And I'm glad I tried it out. And I think maybe, you know, in a pinch, I would maybe try it. It's definitely very obvious that you're just wearing shirts. And I wish there was somewhere that you could put the sleeves. I don't know. I don't know if you guys have any ideas of different ways you could do with the sleeves so they're less obviously sleeves. There's a way to tuck them in somewhere. But I do really like the neckline with the collars and the buttons down the front. If you could DIY a dress like this and cut off the sleeves and sew it together, that would actually be kind of cute, I think. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is definitely different than the videos I typically do, but it was a lot of fun and I would love to hear your thoughts on it. Thank you for watching and thank you so much to those of you supporting me on Patreon and I'll see you in the next one.